Several recent power outages across the desert are leaving Coachella Valley residents in extreme heat with little relief. News Channel 3 Shay Lawson tells us more about the multiple outages that happened this week. Imperial Irrigation District workers spent Saturday restoring power in Indio after a vehicle crashed into an electrical box, which left almost 500 customers without power. One Southern California Edison spokesperson warns people on what to do if they see a power line down. Do not touch it or approach it. Stay at least 100 feet away and call 911 immediately. Other cities have experienced power outages in the last week due to drivers crashing into power poles, including 400 Indio customers on Thursday after a pursuit crash. On Friday, over 1,000 customers in Indio. And also on Friday, another crash left an unknown number of Cathedral City residents without power. The SCE spokesperson says it's important for residents to know what to do if their power unexpectedly goes out in extreme heat. Check emergency supplies to ensure they have a battery operated radio, a flashlight and fresh batteries. Keep the refrigerator and freezer closed. Thousand Palms residents also faced power outages on Friday, along with Palm Desert residents who experienced an outage due to an underground electrical issue, according to SCE. But our house is just, you know, they're just so hot, have to drive around. SCE says equipment issues left Palm Springs residents without power on Saturday. With all the power outages across the Coachella Valley, SCE's spokesperson says if you experience one, to report it. Whenever there's an outage, our crews work as quickly as safety allows to restore power. Shay Lawson, News Channel 3. There are several cooling centers across the Coachella Valley if you need to plan a place to get out of the heat. And to find one closest to you, you can visit our website, KESQ.com.